Tyler Staniland of Selling the OC announced he and wife Brittany Snow have split after two years of marriage. The John Tucker Must Die actress never appeared on the Selling Sunset spin-off. But she was referenced, and her marriage was a central topic of conversation after Tyler found himself in the middle of the office drama. While the Oppenheim Group employees were out partying, newbie agent Kayla Cardona tried to kiss the married man. Though she apologized to Tyler and appeared to clear the air, the drama didn't stop. Alex Hall and Polly Brindle also demanded apologies from Kayla. However, some called the two women hypocrites, as Polly stripped naked in front of Tyler, while Alex gave him a nosy. The surfer himself was also called out for being too flirtatious with co-workers. Now, less than a month after the reality series premiered, his marriage has come to an end. On Wednesday, September 14, Tyler announced the split on his Instagram. Alongside a black and white photo of him and Britney, he wrote, After time and consideration, Brit and I have made the difficult decision to separate. This decision was made with love and mutual respect for one another. The recipient of selling the OC's infamous nosy added that both parties realized we need to take some time and make sure we are each living our most fulfilling and authentic lives. He continued, we started this journey as best friends and our relationship will continue to be a priority not only for us but for our dog Charlie. This dog was infamously referenced on the show, when Tyler ranked Charlie and surfing above his then-wife. Finally, he wrote, We sincerely appreciate your support and ask for privacy as we navigate this new chapter. While most of the comments wished both parties the best, there were also snarkier remarks. Some left nose emojis, seemingly referencing the infamous Beach Day Act. Others said the split wasn't surprising considering the way he behaved on the Netflix series. Many questioned if his Netflix fame was worth it. In post-show interviews, Alex defended flirting with Tyler, and swore she'd do it all again. Meanwhile, Tyler admitted the ranking was not a good joke, and seemed to hint that the Pitch Perfect star was not happy when she watched the show. Kayla also expressed frustration about how he managed to avoid any blame. She accused him of flirting with her before the attempted kiss, emphasizing she wouldn't have tried it if he hadn't. She also said Britney should worry about Alex Hall. While Polly, Alex, and Tyler appeared certain they were in the right, social media reactions completely disagreed. Polly and Alex were named bullies, and blasted for demanding apologies from Kayla. Many viewers echoed fan favorite Alexandra Jarvis, who memorably asked if Alex thought she was married to Tyler. But the 33-year-old was heavily criticized as well, with viewers pointing out every instance of him acting inappropriately with co-workers. Between this and the ranking, he was accused of not respecting his famous wife. Considering how much drama came from his married status, it will be interesting to see how the split changes office dynamics. After all, one of the most memorable arcs on Selling Sunset happened when Chris O. Staus and Justin Hartley divorced. However, Netflix has yet to officially renew the spin-off for a second season. Selling the OC Season 1 is available to stream on Netflix. Source, Tyler Stanilin, Instagram. With a gentle touch you tell me what all of I have to share it must be cause how you are what I own you only you do know you do know only you do know only you do know now the carries still moving still say
walking 